So, if you guys aren't familiar with the splash shot, um, I was bringing come on this gun over to Left 4 Dead 2. So I just replaced this gun with the splatter shot and I'll show you how I did it. Animators, they actually move all of these bones around. Applied on top of the skeleton is is the 3D mesh. And think of the mesh as like the muscles of a person. You know, it gives the the um, the character's form and then applied on top of the mesh is the texture and you can think of that like the skin. You can think of that as skin, it gives the character color, etc, etc. Yes, this, this program, these 3D modeling programs, you know, anything 3D um, is used with programs like this. So, in the game industry, in in the 3D film industry, this is what people are using. Not not specifically this program, but they're using programs similar to this. I guess I'm gonna appreciate movie staff more for their hard work and animation after watching this. Still can't understand a thing. If there's something that you don't understand, um, I'll try to explain to you. What I did was, I just said, hey, attach that gun, attach Max to that hand. So now when any existing animation moves this hand will also move that gun as well. I hope that makes sense. So there, we have the model inside the game now. Now the next thing we want to do is we want to texture it. What I generally like to do and what people should do is paint directly on the image. And look, it shows up on the gun as well. Boom, here we go. You got the splatter shot. Here is the final weapon. Final look. After you modif after you texture it, this is what it looks like. See now they all have splatter shots as well. They all have splatter shots. So I replaced the tank with where is it? That. <laughs> that is the tank now. Oh, I, I gotta turn off. <laughs> Isn't he scary? <laughs> oh. No, no, I just got death charge. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, nobody saw that. I wasn't streaming that. Bye, have a good night. Thanks for attending the stream. I hope that, uh, that little insight that I gave you on, on modding games and bringing the Splatoon stuff into another game. I hope, I hope that was kind of educational, insightful, whatever. Uh, yeah, I will see you guys later. Bye.